Hi folks, this is your old Pat on Cloud. When, when I say insulate your refrigerator or freezer with one of these sheets using Velcro and a cloth cover, don't cover the heat ports or the heat vents in the back of the refrigerator in the front. You only cover the seat, top of the refrigerator ceiling. You cover the both sides and you cover the door. You do not go all the way around the free, free refrigerator or freezer. You can prepare Norsemen. No, the Americans are stupid and they might do that. Only three or four spots you want to cover. The doors, the top of the refrigerator, the sides, right side and left side. You want to leave, not all the way to the bottom, don't cover the heat vents, and if you're not sure, ask Old Uncle Al. I know what I'm doing with this stuff. You guys don't. Thank you, prepared Norseman. Let's see, what do we have to do? i got too many notes. Please check out uh, Patriot Farms, Chasing Life, SD Mountain Man, and The Underground. He's the ones collecting silver, and SD's doing, I think, bushcrafting. I hope he's doing bushcrafting. Okay, and Chasing Life's trying to figure out a way to survive. And Patriot Farm is a homesteader, I believe. So please check them out. And you don't want to know about that. Last month was baking powder, uh, baking soda, and yeast. Too much tartar and vinegar. And we already went over that. And I forgot what I wrote down for. What did I wrote down? For. I gotta find it. Uh, for. Uh, shoot. Got too many cryptic notes. And the sympathy card I'm going to have to send off pretty quick. <clears throat> okay, first things first. We are going to do the volt bag. Okay, this is number six. I keep putting it off, but it's a deep look at a bolt bag. Now, a bolt bag is not a bug out bag. So let's bring it up. It's not these things. A bolt bag is not an EDC bag. It is not a bug out bag or bug in bag. God, no, it's not a get out of dodge bag. It's not a tactical or mission bag. It's not a get home bag. It's not an inch bag. And it's not a ditch bag, marine or sea type. Okay? A bolt bag. Get it through your little heads. Is not these things. These things are other things that you carry. And a bolt bag is the last ditch. Okay, last ditch. There's no going back here. Bug out bag's on fire. You, you lost your EDC bag. You're in a country <coughs> that you cannot reach your bug out bag or car bag or nothing. When it's totally gone, it's on fire. Shit, uh, you know, hit the fan and the fan gets hit by a meteorite. That's how bad it is. All right. You always make multiple bags at your vacation place, at school, at work, in, in safe in foreign territories, blue states like California or New York. I get really upset because people don't listen about that. Okay. Many people are still confusing this all the time. Wrong. Do not confuse a bolt bag with these items I mentioned here. Okay? It's not that. Okay? It's not those bags. A bolt bag is the last final ditch. Everything hit the fan. You're screwed. Everything is gone. That's the only thing that's going to keep you alive for the next 24, 28 hours. Nothing else. Your bug out bag's gone. Your car's gone. You're on foot. There's people with AKs and machetes after your butt. This is go time. A true bolt bag, definition, a true bolt bag provides 
uh, survival or survivalist, 24 to 48 hours of bare essential items. Need to escape from a hostile environment and turn alive. We turn alive. Main headline. Don't care about your identity. Don't care about your bank account. Don't care about how much weapons you have. Thing is, this is supposed to get you out of danger and alive. Only carry the bare essential that you need or want to need or never be without at any time, no matter what the event, mission, or disaster. This is a supplement kit that you tuck away with your bug out bag and everything else. You are not playing Batman. You're not playing Rambo. None of that crap works in this. This is real world experience. Reality is going to hit you harder than anything else. Okay. And that's about it. I was going to write something else, but I forgot to put it down on the card. So that's it for now. I'll catch you later. I'll let you tactical guys mull about it. I know all you preppers are wondering, what is Uncle Alan talking about? And half you homesteaders like, duh, time to feed the pigs? No. Get it through your little heads. A bolt bag is it. All right, I was going to call it an it bag, but a lot of people confuse it with inch bag. No, this is it. Things already hit the fan. Everything gone to pot. There's no resupply. You're on your own. This is it. Final countdown. You had it. I'll catch you later, kids. You have a nice night. And I got to say, kids, stop telling you kids. Folks, you folks have a nice night. I'll see you in a couple of minutes.